What's up, Guam? I'm Dave Delgado. Welcome to KUAM Sports. Thanks for watching. I have some running news to pass along to you in just a bit. But first off, your dial rent to own Athlete of the Week. Check it out. We're here at Dial Rentone, Daddy Doe for our Dial Rentone Athlete of the Week. Today we have soccer player Cam Uggen, and here to present him with a check is Paul. Paul. Hey, Cam. Uh, congratulations on behalf of uh, Dial Rentone, uh, being selected as the Dial Rentone Athlete of the Week. And who would you like to donate this uh, check to? I would like to donate it to a game. All right, Cam, uh, you play soccer for the Panko Strikers in the Landshark Beach Soccer League. Can you just tell us a little bit about the league and how beach soccer is played? It's a five on five, about three quarters, 15 minutes each. It's a little bit harder to run on. All right, it's a smaller field, uh, a lot more goals are scored. Maybe you're looking at maybe five goals in the head. It's definitely a defensive game. It's uh, pretty much a team where everyone has to play together for goals to, be, to happen. Okay, uh, you guys are currently holding uh, second place. Let's talk about the team in general and uh, who are some of the players that have helped you guys uh, secure that second spot so far this early in the season. All right, you got FJ Chargaloff, um, Sean Spindell. We got our main keeper, Julio. Uh, I'm not sure his last name, but he's one of the key guys that helped us get past these past games. You scored four goals in the last game against the Pago Bay uh, Disasters. What was the difference maker? You guys were able to put up a lot of numbers. What was the difference maker in that game against uh, Pago Bay? Well, the first time around, we challenged them. We came into the game uh, underestimating them. So this time we knew what we had to do was pretty much an offensive game. And uh, for the men's league, you play for Shipyard, uh, a team that is pretty well known in the men's league. Uh, what's next for uh, Shipyard and uh, when do you guys hit the field again? probably be hitting the field in September. Um, we have a lot of new recruits and we do have some returnees, but other than that, um, I think for the rest of the se I mean for this upcoming season, we should have a good team. All right. All right, congratulations. Stay tuned to our next Die Run to Own Athlete of the Week. KUAM Sports Athlete of the Week is brought to you by the Catholic Social Service Run for Hope and Charity 5K takes place on Saturday, July 27th at Chamorro Village. Showtime for the run is at 5.30 with a go time set for 6. T-shirts will be given out to the first 500 finishers along with medals and door prizes. Proceeds from the run will help with programs funded by the Catholic Social Service. You can register for the run at Hornet Sports in Tumunning or at the Catholic Social Service's main office in Barragata. For more information, visit www.catholicsocialserviceguam.org where registration forms can be downloaded or call 635-1441. Well, that's going to do it for sports. We're back right after this.